It's the King, King J, back with another video. Today, we're talking about the robotic chick, Alyssa. Now, she is very, very strong. With the chainsaws, she can be very aggressive, but she can also play defensive as well. So I'm gonna give you some key moves and I'm gonna tell you about the stuff she can do when she's in heat or when her chainsaws get heat. Let's get into it. Now, Alyssa is a very, very, very defensive character, but once the chainsaws are out, it's no holds bar. That uh, is crazy uh, what our chainsaws can do. But I just want to talk you through a couple of things. So obviously she has a stance where she can go and get her chainsaws out, which is destructive, which is down one plus two. She has boot, which is four, three plus four. And she has backup, which is down back one plus two, right? But before we get into those things, I just want to talk to you about them stances because the key moves include her going into certain stances. So first things first, talk about the stuff that I think is good. So we've got one, one, which I think is good. Four, which is homing. And then, you know, you, you could do follow up from there. I think one, two, uh, down two at the, I'd say beginning to intermediate, intermediate stages are good. Two, two is a 12 frame punish, which does, it does damage and knock down. Got three, two, which makes it go into heat, but we're not going to talk about heat engages just yet. We've got three, four, two, which makes her go into her destructive stance. We've got forward three, two which makes her go into a destructive stance again. And then we have four forward one plus two, which on counter hit does that. Then we've got forward forward two three, which I would say is a combo ender. So you do your combo once you've finished, you know, the tornado attack, four four two three is your ender. So we've got two one. Uh, 4 two, one which is another heat engager but that puts you into the destructive uh, stance or destructive form should I say and then you've got 2-3-3 three, three, which is a combo ender as well I would say this is good for the wall depending on how you splat them then you have down 3 which then Push you into the you know destructive starts. You could do down three one, which is a common one, which is a high, right? So yeah, just be careful, just be careful. You know, because once you're in the stance, I could do anything I want to. I can literally just do a low for no reason. I could do a mid. You know, so you just be careful. So then you got back free, which is homing. Homing mid. You have back one plus two, which puts you in destructive form. Up. So you've got up forward three, up forward three, two. You have up forward four, four, which is your, basically, I would say it's, it's a launcher, right? So it's a launcher. You have down back four. Which is good to catch people off guard. You know, obviously your mid poke, down forward one as well. Down back four. So you could probably follow that up with down three. Like, it's not guaranteed, but yeah, you could just follow it up for more pressure. And then crouch one plus two. So with this, you do down back, you do down three, then press down back, and then down one plus two. Just to cancel the the stance, which is a backup stance. Because if you do try to press one plus two straight away, you'll get that. So you press down back down one one plus two. Maybe that's a bit on the intermediate side. Maybe I shouldn't have snuck that in on a beginner guide, but yeah, that's something you can do if you want to cheese people out. You got you got while standing two, you got while standing two free. You can do whatever you want from that. And then I think that is it in terms of all the key moves that I would like you to use for this character. So, 
we've got heat engages with destructive stance let's go for destructive stance so in destructive stance you have one which i think is good it's mid and it knocks down does a lot of chip damage as well on block you've got two so if you do two two oh sorry so i did two uh this move here let me do it one more time does tornado right so that was two i did two one plus two for that one i probably think it's two one yep two one okay cool so for this you've also got two one two sorry forward two one two Four, two, one, two. Does not combo, but I can only assume on this one. On counter, it does definitely. Uh, forward one plus two. Sorry. So yeah, this move here. You are definitely gonna want to use this. Downward is a low. So which, as you can see by the, the frames, she's just constantly plus when she's, when she's doing this stuff and it hits. Plus 15 there, so that's one plus two. Forward one. Down freeze the sidestep. You can press up and free or down and free. And it will make you move around like this. And then down two. So those are the stuff from destructive. From backup, which is back down back one plus two, is this one. I would say the ones the moves you should be using is one. Three. I didn't. Sorry. There we go. And then four, which is like the big knee. Because on block. only by the style like which i find crazy because you have this yeah you, you know sorry you have this you have one which is plus four don't why it keeps doing that but yeah and then you have this as well which is a high so you've got to guess quite a bit you don't want to duck and eat the knee because the knees minus nine. So you got to be careful. Right? So yeah, that is that. Obviously you got boots, which you could press two or three. I think those are the ones that you should be concentrated on. Two, three, add uh one plus two, which is unblockable high. And then four is the big launcher, but you're really minus. So if you want to take the risk, you can, but at your own discretion. Right, now, in terms of the heat engages, the heat engages are as follows. Let's take this off. The heat engages is 3-2, which is 13 frame. Punish, you could use 1 plus 2, which she throws her head at you. Which she has 4-2-1. She has up 4-2. And then she has... Down back, uh, down back one, what is it? Uh, down back one plus two, two. Hold on. Oh, sorry, down two. Sorry, let me do that again. Down back one plus two. If it's gonna work. Down one plus two. Forward two, one, two. Sorry. I had the notes here, put down back, it's actually down. But yeah, so. As you can see, she has dual boost. And her chainsaws are red, right? So she's ready to do some serious damage. As soon as she comes out of heat, they go back to blue. So it's, it's like their uh, chainsaws are overheating. So if we go back into that now, let's do it again. She has access to forward one plus four. Damn, that burn it out quick, boy. And then she has access to down one plus two. So 
so you could just get it out like that. Which, I, I don't know why it kind of, like, if I'll be honest, like, personally, I don't know why it would take off heat. I know people don't really like, like the character like that, but, yeah, I don't know why it would kind of take off heat. But, yeah, so you could do this. Does a lot of damage. So yeah, she's she's pretty terrifying, to say the least. I did okay. So in dual boost, let's get it out there. So she has forward one, one plus two. Uh, Two, four, two, one, two. So like these moves, yeah, terrifying. <laughs> I don't want to be get. If we let me just show you Chip as well. That's one thing we need to show you because then you'll understand why this starts is so terrifying. Also as well, when you're in, when you're in, uh, when you're in that starts as well, you cannot do heat burst. So like, look, I'm gonna show you now. I'm mashing it. You can see by my that you cannot. Right. So, you'd have to activate Heat Burst when you're not in that stance. So now, let me do it again. I really want to show you how bad it gets. Like, there's so much chip when she's in that stance. So, yeah, you just have to be careful. Here is a heat smash. Sorry, I want to add this in before I close out the video properly. And on block, let's see what it looks like on block. Wow. So you could chain, you could stay in chainsaw by pressing one plus two. Crazy, right? So you still got pressure. So for full crouch, uh, down back one plus two. She has this one, which does a nice 45 damage. She has the up forward one plus two, which can be ducked or it can be broken, right? I feel like this does quite a bit of damage. I don't know if it, it always done 40 damage. It might might have, I can't remember, the tech seven damage. But this does damage to you. You can duck or you can break one plus two. Just make sure. Obviously, you got the attack reversal as well. It's just easier to do it here. So that is back one plus two or back two plus four. This is for punch. This is for punches, I believe. I don't think it's for kicks. So let me let me just let me just try a kick anyways, just to be on the safe side. I don't. I've always known it to be punches, but I've never seen anyone do a high kick. So let's set last to do. I think a standing four will be okay. Okay. Oops. Let's do it one more time. Maybe I was a bit slow. So it is punch and kicks. And it does it does 25 damage. Also as well, another key move before I end this that I forgot about. Two, running two, you need to abuse this. This move is so good, right? Not only it does it knock down. Yeah, sorry, running two. So you get running two, full one plus two, 50 damage. No count here. I don't only that, you could go into chainsaw. So if you get run into, you can just press one plus two and it goes into chainsaw. And then you, you start you start all your nonsense. Like that is crazy. You know? But yeah, that is it. Obviously, I hope you lot enjoyed. 
I like, I, I've always kind of wanted to dabble with this character. I think this character is pretty good. There's probably a bunch of moves that I know Alyssa Bates will be like, oh, but you didn't tell them this and that. I kind of want everyone to get into the character before they experiment and explore. So, yeah. And as you can see here, it says, what could you, what could be done? Like, if you're in destructive form, like, all of these stuff do a lot of chip damage. Like I was saying. So, yeah. His character is very interesting, very strong. Can play defensive game. You know, can play defensive, can be aggressive once she has chainsaws there. And I like the touch that, you know, her chainsaws go red when she's in heat. To say that, bro, that she's probably like, you know, she's overworking, you know, the chainsaws. Like, it's it's sick. And then it goes back to blue again. Absolutely sick. But yeah, this has been King J. I hope you lot enjoyed. Leave a comment, subscribe, and all of that good stuff. And I'll be back again with another video guide soon. Take it easy, everyone. Peace.